Hello guys and girls, Roger back with another video. I am an enterprise solutions architect working at AWS. So until this time, uh, we have looked at running CloudFormation using Jenkins uh, code pipeline, right? But how do you run a CloudFormation using code pipeline, which has input parameters? Like when you run your CloudFormation from console, you have a way to go give user inputs. But how do you give uh, inputs uh, when you are running your CloudFormation uh, using code pipeline? Uh, in this video, we are going to uh, learn that useful technique. Uh, all right, let's get into it. Uh, so for this, we are going to use a file called a template configuration file. So a template configuration file uh, is a JSON formatted text file uh, where you can specify template parameter values, uh, stack policy, and tags. Uh, so if I go back to my Visual Studio code, uh, so on the left is a CloudFormation template, uh, which is creating a SNS topic. And for the endpoint of the SNS topic, it's referencing this SNS email uh, parameter, uh, which is an input parameter, right? Like the user uh, has to input the parameter. And then uh, while spinning up this CloudFormation resource, it's going to use that input parameter. On the right is our template configuration file. Pretty straightforward. Uh, in the parameter section, uh, you can code the input parameters and the values that you want to pass. Uh, so let's say uh, our uh, parameter name is SNS email. And then you say, hey, I want to pass this value uh, AWS is best at the rate of email.com uh, as the input parameter. So next step is if I go back to my GitHub repository, uh, so you can see that uh, we already have this SNS with parameter JSON, uh, which is the CloudFormation template. And then I uploaded uh, SNS template parameter.json in the same uh, repository, right? So if I click this, SNS with parameter is the actual CloudFormation. SNS template parameter.json is the template configuration file. Um, okay, so now let's uh, create the pipeline with this knowledge in mind. Okay, we are back in a code pipeline. We're gonna click create pipeline. Pipeline name, SNS parameter dash CFD. How about that? Uh, click existing service role. Uh, we are going to use the same service role that we have been using. Code pipeline demo service role. Click next. Uh, source provider GitHub. Click connect to GitHub. Okay, repository, uh, CloudFormation demo, branch master, GitHub webhooks. Click next. So we're gonna skip the build step. Uh, this is where all the magic happens. Deploy provider, click AWS CloudFormation. Let's say uh, create or update a stack. Stack name, how about SNS with parameter. So artifact name is the CloudFormation template name, right? So this we already know, source RC artifact, and the file name will be the name of the template. Uh, so this will be SNS with parameter. So just gonna copy this. So remember, this is the actual CloudFormation, paste this. And now this is template configuration. Uh, specify the configuration file that you uploaded. So click this and the artifact name, source artifact. So it says go to the same GitHub repository. And here we are going to point it to the template configuration file. Uh, so this is where we're passing the input value. So just copy the name. Go back to code pipeline. Okay, paste this. And this role, we're going to use the same role. So even though this says S3, uh, we included SNS policies here as well. Uh, so don't get confused by the name. Okay, click Create Pipeline. Okay, so it's gonna run. We're gonna let it run for a little bit. Okay, so uh, this ran. So now let's check out um, 
if it indeed took the input parameter. Uh, so we're gonna click this CloudFormation link. It's gonna open the CloudFormation stack for us. Uh, SNS with parameter. Uh, so let's go to resources. Okay, it created the SNS topic. Uh, so if we click this parameters, uh, it's going to show the input parameters. So if we click this, there you go, it can, you can see the SNS email variable uh, it got from the template configuration file. And if we want to check out uh, the SNS itself, uh, let's go to the SNS. Okay, the name is SNS with parameter. Let's go there. Okay, SNS with parameter, alert SNS topic. 1MX, okay, this is the one, SNS with parameter, alert SNS topic. So if we click this and go to subscriptions, here is the endpoint. This is how you can pass values to the input parameters of a CloudFormation template and uh, use it in code pipeline. All right, guys and girls, that is the video. If you like this video or the content in my channel, uh, please feel free to uh, like and subscribe. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.